Welcome to join the class to learn the trend style page trend, the old frame first routine. Last class, we learned in the third Buddhist warrior part the model. Today, we are gonna learn in the next form. It's called the leaning punch. The form is based on a fundamental skill of trend style page trend. It's called a double hands cross silky railing inwards. So we're gonna learn it as well. Let's do the warm up first. Let's pad our acupuncture points and meridians as a warm up. The A one following, practice together. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Side elbow. One, two, three, eight, two, two, four, five, six, seven. Change. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm pet. One, two, three, four, five, six.
Okay, let's search our arm. Four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Reverse. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, next. One forward, one back. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Reverse. Two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's see the right arm. That's the left arm. Okay, everyone follow me. Circle. Go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We change. Go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, next. Let's review and practice what we have already learned. Let's start from the opening form to the third Buddhist warrior panza model. So everyone follow me, practice together. Let's do the same direction. Close your feet. Keep your body natural upright. Bend your knees, bend your hip joint. Lower your shoulders, your elbows, extend your palms, and your middle fingers touch your feet slightly. Close their mouth. Let your tongue touch your roof and mouth. Sing. Everything down. Shift right, heel up, stand on leg, and step up. Shift, think again. Raise your arms. And then lower your shoulders, elbows, and the palms. Lower your palms to your level, level. Thing. Push to left, body shift to right. And then shift to back, and push to right, body to up. Shift to right, thing. Stand on leg. Step out. Turn to right and shift to left. Turning your palms, keep it right to in. Sing. Four. One, two, three, four, five. Next, landing tight toe. Bring your left toe in, then leave hind toe. Next, six sitting and a full closing. Thank you. 
Double hand, sit really. Four and a back. Second, Buddhist warrior on the border. Okay, before we learn in the leaning punch form, we need to learn a fundamental skill of chain strategy trend. It's called the double hands cross steel grinning. Then you will learn the leaning punch. It's very easy. Okay, first let me show you the steel grinning form. So you can practice at home as much as you can. Just the left, right, left, right. See? Okay, let's learn it. It's just the first learn, learning the footwork. So the other one, I face you. This is your this is your left leg. This is your right leg. Put the, your weight 70 on 70% 70 weight on your left leg. We just learn footwork. The footwork is easy before we have already learned it. 
it's just a review. I said one, it's just the body turning to left and the shift the weight to the right leg, 60. One. Well, after that, your body already turned 45. You should check your shoulder and hip joint. Before I, I thought it like this, you imagine there are two the headlights of a car on a hip joint. So one, in this direction. Next, two, just turning body. You already shift the weight, 60 percent weight on your right leg. Then next, I said, one, shift 60 percent of your weight on your left leg. And two, turn your body. See, that's before we have already learned, just the review, okay? Everyone follow me. This is, I face you, let's go. Then one, 60 to, left, to right. Two, 70 to right. Then one, 60 to left. Then two, 70 on left. So I'll give you a number, just help you do it. But if you do it, very well, then you can just go one, turning, two, turning. You can make the form smoothly, evenly. Don't just shake it, one, two, one, two, don't do that, okay? That's the key point, I'll say it again for you. Make the distance between your leg is the stem. If I say one, stem, two, stem, don't do that. One, two, change, don't change it, okay? Just code it, code it, one, two, one, Two. Okay, that's the full work. It's easy. Now, now your hands. This is the pull your both hands. We first learn hands, okay? This is the diagonal. Diagonal. 45. Don't do that. See? 40, diagonal. Then, chop your right arm, palm, like the opponents, chop your neck, 45. This is the, this palm, put it on the side of your hip joint. See, this is like this. This palm like this, this palm like this, okay? Be careful. This palm, Put your beside of your hip joint. That's the lateral line. We call it this palm is the root of your palm. Don't uh, make your root of palm over your lateral line. You need to put a front. Don't do that. If this way, you make your energy up. You just sit. See? Yes. So not over your lateral line. Okay? That's the diagonal. Next, I said one, just the turning, make your both arm. Is flat. This is the up, palm up, and palm down. See, one. See? This is the one. Okay. Next, I said two. See, change. I still give you two numbers, the two steps. Follow the footwork. One two. before we said one, two, one, two. You need to make them move together with the coordination. Okay, go hands. Everyone follow me. This is your right arm. That's your left palm. Move together. Go. Then one. See, I said, I said one like this. Then two. Moving. Coordination. Check it. Yes. Go. Then one. Two. Make your left brain control your right arm. Right brain, control left arm. Okay, let's go. One, two. Don't shake your hands. I already see some of you, you, you <laughs> move, move your body with an arm, both are moving, coordination. Don't do that, see, watch. Even that's good, but you see, this is not good because I want to, I just show you one part. See, from palm that's, 45. I said one, flat, right? Next, two, 
that's 45, right? With my shift, shift here. One, two, my leg finished, hand finished. So let's do that. One, that finished, then move hand, two, that's all good. I want to check it, finished. Also, don't forget, where is your rotation? Where is the revolution? So even you moving together, stop together, but your palm, your, your revolution, the rotation already, already stops. See, if you do that, see, already. One, next, see, I said two, you already finished. You're just moving. This is not a good. That's just the arm, for this arm, just to have the revolution. You lost the rotation. You need the next one. To finish. Yes. So for this palm, the same things. See, I said one, right? The next step. Go two, 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 finish. Don't do that. See, just already palm flat. Fast palm down. It's just like they're moving. That's not good. Yes, that's the most people will get the problems. We just move arm, lost your palm rotation, which means that you couldn't do the form with the coordination. Stop. Okay, everyone follow me. Just the one palm, go. 45. 45. Okay, next is the one, palm down. Two, 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 stop. Okay, next, one, palm up. Next, two, 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 so if you really want to get the tangible benefits, you need to do this movement very well. Not just the moving heads, because you lost the rotation and the revolution work together. Okay, let's do both arms together. Okay, slowly. First, we just think about both arms. Don't move leg, it's difficult. So one. Then two, stop. So one, say two, 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 stop. See, don't. So some of you like this already. See, see, my this palm problem is one is good. Two, they already already that's two. They already like this, just moving. Let's see if this arm is wrong. Okay, you need a one, two, 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 finish. Then one, two, finish. Yes. Okay, next, let's put the hands, the leg together. This is very difficult. Okay, go. 40, 45. See, when I do that movement, this 45, right? If you change the direction, that's this, this 45. This 45, see? 45. 45. Okay, good. This form, you can practice at home by our staff as much as you can. This form can train you to each part of our body, work together with coordination very well. So one, two, One, two, we call it the double hands, cro double cross, silk railing inwards. If you, the hands outwards is the cloudy hands, right? We, 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 today we're just uh, learning the inwards, okay? Just to make sure your revolution, rotation, work together with coordination. One. Two, one, two. Yes, 
Okay, that's I. Let's go same direction. Go. One, two. One, two. One, two. Stop. Okay. Yes. So uh, don't worry about it. So you need, need you just need to take time to practice every day. So no one can in a short time do it very well. Uh, but you need to just think about each time. You need to make sure you do it correctly. Just the coordination, coordination, think about it. Also think about where is the location, where is the revolution, you need to make them working together with the coordination. That's very important. Okay? So now we can start learning the linear punch. I think it is very easy for you to learn in the form because you're already learning the basic fun, uh, fundamental skill, skill of the, the form. Let's divide the linear punch form in two parts to learn it. The first part, there are four steps. That means Demonstrate for you first. Hold up the end of the third Buddhist warrior pound model. Just watching. I demonstrate for you. Okay. I will this one. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. Okay, follow me learning. This is the first part. There are four steps. We first learning the full work. Let's go same direction. In the end, of the third Buddhist warrior pound model. So our body, 50% of our body weight on your each leg. You sit down, sit on a high chair. If we are each leg is 50% of weight on each leg. Next, as a one, it just uh, shift 10%. Move 10% from your right leg to your left leg, which means shift 60% of weight to your left leg. As a one, it's 60, 60. Before the 50, 50, okay? Next, I say one, 60 on your left leg. Next, I said two, shift the back. Still 50, 50. Okay, next, I said one, shift the to right, 60, 40. Next, the two, shift the back, still 50, 50. Okay, we do the uh, shift the back and the force twice. Okay, let's do one, two, one, two. So, see it very easy. Also, I just exaggerate, show you, because just the 10% weight move. This is the, the body moving, the range of your body moving is very small. You couldn't feel it, feel your body moving. Because just 10%, 50%, so one little bit, then two, one little bit. See, just 10%, not like before, 60, 70, just like this, see? 60 back, 60 back, just 10%. And it looks like that didn't move any. But the small moving also is a very important in the trench star teddy train. You need to catch up the small details. Okay? Everyone follow me. I face you, let's do same direction. 50 50. So follow me, go. I'm in a mirror. So let's go. Follow me, go. One. This is your right leg. That's your left leg. Okay, let's go. 160 to your left. Two back, 50 50. Next, 160. Two, see. 
Okay, next, if I give you four steps, one, two, one, two, but you don't shake your body, one, two, one, two, you need a very, oh, very gently, smoothly, gently, smoothly, yes. Follow me one more time, go. So, one, two, one, two, okay? So, you just think about 50 to 60, then back to the 50, then 60, 50. I exaggerate, do, do it, you follow me. Remember, I exaggerate you, I let you see it clear, but you don't follow me to the too big, okay? Go, just 50, 50, go. You don't do that, okay? Because you just uh, separate feet, the wind and your shoulder. Okay, I just separate my leg, leg. Follow me, go. One, two, one, two, and this. Okay? So then I face you. Let's go the same direction like this. One, two. You couldn't feel it. See, you just can't feel, but I couldn't know how much you're moving. You, you know, it looks like a <laughs> decent movie, any, but the body, the people feel very beautiful. Okay, so let's learn the hands. I'll say this is a while. The first one, hold the warrior, palm them order. Next, I say one. So, one, one, see, one. The first photo, the one, like this, see, one. Next, I said two, two, see, separate to a hip joint. With the hip joint, before we, there's a, there's a, there's a little go. One, two, right? See, 50, 50 already. But, see, this is my palm, not flat. First, it's just a turning, then two, see? This is my palm, can you see it? I'm gonna go this, 45. Like the other one, next I says, your thumb turning, like the silk running, turning, like this, turning, 45. A small detail, you couldn't feel it. People like the, uh, could have, people couldn't feel it. Just one, two, okay, 45. See, not like this, right, 45. Next, I said one, See, back the turning, pinking up, turning to shoulder. Next two, thumb turning, cross the hands in front of the body. So this is your right palm, then let's go from there, here. So follow me one more time, go, let's, let's do it, go. One, two, one, two. Yes. So now we can put your hands with the leg, shift, shift together. So even the hands moving, the range is bigger than your leg moving, but you need the same time. I said, why you need the last one? One, two, one, two, finish. At the same time, when leg finish, body, your hands need to finish at the same time. Okay, go, follow me. Go, one, two, one, two. Push. Yes. Your arms are very lazy. They don't want to move any because the energy comes from your leg. Your leg moving, you make energy, lead the hands moving. See, one, open, someone hold you. Just one, separate, don't hold you. Next, uh, turn, this one, you see? Someone hug you behind their body, hug you, see? So don't move, you don't move do so directly, you need to turn body, turn back, then turn, go. But don't learn that shake your body. You need to make, make, make smoothly easily. One, two, one, two, 50, 50. Yes, make it beautiful. Okay? 
Uh, let's form it one more time. The first part, go. One, two, one, two, Let's learn in the second part. Second part, there are eight steps. We will use the one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, four times. We call it the eight steps. So the footwork is easy. Like before, the same as before. So just the first step, 50-50, okay? And then one, Move to left 60. Two, use the left inside the heel, slide with the ground. Two, then just as much as you can. If you feel uncomfortable, you can step smaller. You don't need to slow. Just here, 50 feet, okay? One, two, it's 70, 30. This is the first one, too. So everyone follow me, go. One, 60 to left. Two, slide right foot, two. This is the first one, too. See, see, very easy, right? Just, I, I'm just doing that, I'm mirror like this. One, two. See. Yes. Let's go second, 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 third. And the fourth is very easy. Okay, seven. One, 60 to right, two, 70. Third, one, two is one, 60 to left. Third, uh, 70 to left. Okay, then fourth is seven. One, two. That's the first one, little bit different. Okay, let's learn it. Follow me, okay, eight steps. 50-50 first, put away 50-50 on each of your leg. Then, one, shift the weight, 60 to left leg. Then, turn body, slide the right foot with the inside heel, two, see, 70, 30. Next, second, one, two is one, shift 60 to right. 270 to right. Third one, two is one, shift 60 to left. Turning body, two, 70 to left. Fourth one, two is one, shift 60 to right. Two, 70, 60 to right. See, okay. Everyone follow me, go. One more time. One, two, one. Two, one, two, one, two. Eight steps. See, see, it look, looks like easy, right? Now we learn the hand. The hand still follow the eight steps. Start here. I said one. One, first across the hands, the one. One. Yes. One. Okay, we can do that. Leg, leg, see? See this, the one. Next, a two, we do that, okay? Just one, okay, this is the, here, one. Next. Two. This is the 45, press down. This is the 45, press down. Yes, okay, go. One, two. That's beautiful, see? One, two. Yeah, okay. Go. This first one, two, okay. Third one, two is the same as the, before we're learning the fundamental skill. One, okay, let's go. Two. Third one, two is the one, 
Okay, that's learning the first one, second one, third one. Okay, Everyone follow me, go. One, two, next. One, two, next to the one, two. Okay, that's linking the hands and with the footwork. First one to second and a third one to six steps together. Okay, go. One, two, one, two, one, two. Okay. That's learning the fourth one, two, which means the uh, seventh and eighth steps. Then, first the wide step, one, hold a fist. See, one, hold a fist. So, here we go, one, hold a fist. Both hands hold a fist, okay? Like, one, hold a fist. When I said two, put your left fist to your waist. Two, this left, right palm, right fist is circle. Two. Okay. Here, one, both fists. Two. Yes. Check my left palm, fist, don't put us here. We call it the surface of your fist here. See the touch waist step tightly. Don't do that. See this one. See, okay, here. So just here, start here. This is almost for shoulder. This is the fist. The one and two. Why do two? At the same time, you need to turn your body almost like 30 degrees. If you don't look at the body, your shoulder, elbow, just with your, almost like a letter I, and same surface. I want to turn it 30 degrees, make your hip joint, oh, sorry, elbow, tip of elbow, and the tip of toe, same surface. With the right fist, same surface. Don't look at that. Look. See. So I show you. If you don't turn your body, one, two. See, I want to turn. You couldn't make your elbow with your tip of toe and stay on surface. I want this one. One, two. Yes. Be careful. You both the shoulder. Don't make it up or down. See, you better just like this. Still turning. My just turning my body almost 30 degrees. My shoulders still at the same level. Just a red arm. Just think about just the same surface with elbow with the tip of toe. Almost at the same 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 surface. So why you need to turn 30 degrees? So think about, we call it what called leaning punch. Each movement, if you call it the punch, don't think about first the fist punch. You need to think about shoulder first. So someone stand behind me, very close to me. I just use my, here, I feel someone's behind me. I just use my shoulders. Go. <laughs> Enough, right? Yes. Don't do that. Don't leave it. See? Shoulder at the same level. Just like the carry hand punch. Shifting your body, the shift the weight. You have over 100 pounds of your body. Just need to shift the body. Enough. Nobody can. Get it. 30 degrees. I'm already children. If you, the guys, little bit, 
live away from you, arable. 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 If you still live away from me, feast. See, like this. Punch. You can do that. When it comes to the form, it just make it beautiful. See, like this, enough. See, don't stand close, close, close to me. Keep your social distance, right? Yes. Keep your social distance. Don't touch me. If the guy still still here, airball, go. Go. Yes. I think I did uh, six feet, right? But I couldn't do six feet. <laughs> right. okay. This is uh, also what we can call the form. Is a uh, keep your social distance, right? Yes. Go. One, two. See. Sam, if you want someone here, the elbow. This. Okay, everyone follow me. Next form is beautiful. I show you some some form is the wrong form for you. Just uh, remind you don't do this, don't do that. You feel very beautiful, but I think this is wrong. Also, don't do that. See, either that very beautiful, very stable is wrong. Just sit, be like this, 70, 30, turn body, 30 degrees. Go, go, take a picture. Yes. Good. Don't do that. See, it's still like this. You feel like this, like this. Go, go. Yes. Also, everyone follow me, press several times. But right here, go. One, two, one. Two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, two, okay, so I before I show you just standard form. Also, there are different versions for this form. I show you if you do, if you're lucky, you can do that. See. One, if you but be careful, there's a knee, keep the shank vertical with ground, just a bend in your hip joint. Then here go. Two. Next much. Okay. One. See? Two. This machine still work with the ground. If you couldn't do it, it doesn't matter, okay? Touch the ground. Two. Go. Go. Okay. If you feel uncomfortable, you just like this. One, two, turn your body. Also, it's very good. Good. But I hope you today just think about the way to that. Just keep the shin vertical with the ground. Today maybe you can you can just uh, just brush knee right. Maybe next month you can a little bit lower. Maybe next year touch ground. See, check this and still like this. Don't do that. That's not good. Okay, but don't do it in hurry. Everything depends on your balance. Little bit, little bit, little bit. Step by step. Okay. I feel still, let's practice one more time. Go. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Yes. Okay, so form. See it very easy, but if you want to do it very well, you still need to take a time to do it. Then you have a lot of details you need to catch up. Okay, everyone follow me. Let's press one more time. Let's this direction. Go. Don't forget. Move your hip joint, shift the weight, back and forth twice. Go. One, two, one, two. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. 
Two. Okay, I'll give you more details about the form. When you do that, here I say, wow, you can a little bit change your direction. Look at it. Wow, but then it's small. Two, then a little bit. Wow, but I don't too much. Okay, just a little bit. You feel different. One, two, one, two. Okay, next, watch my eyes where I look. One, look full, right? Two, still look full. Next, I say one, look at the 45. Two, look full. Next, one, look 45. Then, two, look full. Don't do that. One, two, three, don't do that. You need to let your eyes, leave your hands moving. Don't do that. One, two, one, two. That's not good. Okay? It's thinking about your eyes, leave your body moving. Like this. 45, four. 45, look four. Yes. Don't, don't forget. You, I said one, two, one, two. You at least look at the two point. At least one, two, one, two. If you can make more points between your one, two, one, two, make more points to look at it, you're good. You're already improved. Okay, that's all for today. Next class, we are gonna learn in next form is called the green dragon comes out of the water. If you would like to review all the previous classes, what I taught, you can watch the video on my website and uh, my Facebook public page. It can help you review and practice. Okay, thank you very much for joining this class. See you next time. Thank you, Arthur. That's great. Bye-bye. Bye, Ping. Bye, Brandon. Thank you. Bye,